Hey everyone, welcome back, Ron Geek here. Now, majority of the people use a Google Chrome browser on their PC or laptop in order to do the browsing or downloading. And majority of the people also have the slow downloading problem on Google Chrome. So today I will be sharing some effective method that you need to listen properly and you need to apply them. And this will be surely speeding up the Chrome downloading speed. So without any further delay, let's quickly get started. Now before proceeding, let me tell you one thing. The downloading speed of the browser basically depend on the website from which the downloading resource come. So if the website is well done, it can get a relatively good download speed. But some website may provide the poor downloading service and will download very slowly. And there you cannot do much in order to improve the performance. But in case if this is not the issue, next what you have to keep in mind that please switch to a wire connection if you are still using the Wi-Fi connection to download anything or to download any larger file. Next while downloading on Chrome, make sure that you close all the other application and program consuming the bandwidth. And for this what you can do, you can click on your Windows search type resource and from the suggestion click on resource monitor. Here from the top you have to click on network here and very soon it will list you all kind of application and on the right hand side it will show you that what kind of bandwidth it is occupying. So any application that you are not currently using just make a right click on it and click on add process tree or you can manually close it from the task manager as well. Similarly any application that you don't want to use at the time of downloading something you have to go ahead and close them. So you can check the application from here that is occupying the maximum bandwidth and then either you can close from here or you can close from the task manager. Next bring up your Chrome browser, click on the three dot at the right and top. At the bottom you will find the help option, hover upon it and click on about Google Chrome and it will check for the update and if there is any update available make sure that you go ahead and update your Google Chrome browser. Now here in the settings only from the left hand menu option you will have to click on privacy and security. Click on clear browsing data, select to advanced, time range to all time, leave password and autofill form data unchecked and keep all the other options checked. Click on clear data and it will start clearing all the cache, all kind of cookies, all kind of browsing data that is basically slowing down your Google Chrome and even the downloading speed. Once done, now below you will find the add privacy option, click on it. Click on add topics, go ahead and disable it, do the same with the site suggested ad, go ahead and disable it, add measurement, go ahead and disable it. Now the next important thing that you have to do, you need to make sure that you remove all the extension that you are not using, you don't identify or you rarely use it. So on the right and top only you will find the puzzle icon of extension here, click on it. It will list you all kind of extension that you have installed on your computer. Now whichever you don't use or you don't remember when was the last time you used it. So better go ahead and just remove it. On the right of it you will find the three dot and then click on remove from Chrome and it will be removed permanently. Now last and not the least you have to enable the parallel downloading. So open up a new tab, type here Chrome colon flags, hit the enter key. In the search flags you have to look for parallel downloading. I've already enabled this option but you might see the default here. And you can clearly read it says enable parallel downloading to accelerate downloading speed on Mac, Windows, Linux. So click on the drop down, choose it to enable. Click on relaunch. Now go ahead and restart your computer, restart the modem. And of course you will find the difference now. I will not say you find a magic but yes there will be some differences. And now by the end of this video guys I would also like to share a bonus tip and if you really need more speed while downloading on the Google Chrome browser then you can try this free Chrome extension available on Google Chrome web store. I will be sharing the link in the description or even you can search in the Google and once you come up here you can see they have a lot of users and they have got around 4.2 star of rating by 4.6k people. Now in order to read more about it, you can just have a preview here and it says free download manager integration with the browser. It's an official Google Chrome extension by free download manager developer. The sole purpose of this extension is integration with free download manager. FDM is fast and reliable download manager and accelerator that improve your experience with download and help you organize them in easy manner. So this is another thing that you can try. 
once you come up here click on add to chrome click on add extension and after that you will find that your downloading speed has been increased a bit so at least it's better than nothing so that's all guys for today hopefully you found this information useful if yes make sure that you hit the like subscribe and i see you in the next video Bye bye